Welcome to section 3 of basics of human face. Today's session let's learn about ears. What is so intriguing about ears? Obviously various animals have various types of ears. The rabbit has long ears. Elephant has wide ears and Mickey Mouse, as you know, has this sort of ears. Let me finish it off. And uh, there's the other category the cow, the bull. All of them have this sort of ears. So why am I stressing more about this ear? In human, most of the ear is similar. Like most of the shape, size of the ears are similar. But we humans have same sort of ears, the same kind, exact. There is slight difference when it comes to ears. You don't usually notice your friend's ear. So let me put the side look of a ear. This is how the ear looks. And there's a ear piercing. Let's not focus on that. Um, how to draw this? Now let's start the basic thing. Draw a line, divide it into four parts. Since we are trying to do this side right here, this will be the topmost point and this will be the bottom most point. So the limits are within this. Start here, keep a point. Draw a slight curve and then what did I just do? I know it's confusing for you guys. So I have put this thing, I have compared the shape of the ear to something similar which you might remember. Looks familiar? Now, or it's uh, also comparable to kidney, which is also a bean shape. So, draw a bean shape instead of extending this boundary to this corner just take a curve some uh, inches before I have taken it like this way I explained to you properly instead of doing that do the exact thing exact thing as you can see I have left a gap on the other side exact thing once you are there the next step is the details of pinna the ear pinna is most complex structure to draw because it has a lot of curves, there is a role of shadows, lights, play a lot here. So before we move on to the uh, applying shadow and uh, light, we will focus on the outline. Once you get here, try to extend this inward. Inward. And later you have to draw a parallel line. As you can see, I'm just drawing a parallel line till the second part. You have to draw the parallel line, and till the half extend. So totally, we are extending the parallel line to two and a half part. And as you can see, I stop here. Draw a triangle and shape the inward. 
like I did here. So the next part is tricky. You have to further extend till the second part. Now mid of the first second part take this line. Draw a C shape curve. Like this. Now, yes, as you can see, I have put a word yes here. Once you get the C, I have to put yes. <sighs> and the last part which is remaining is wait one second. This part, mid of this, I put a point. There you go. Simple. When we break this complex structure into simple structures, and the last thing to do here is erase this line. There you have the ear, which is simple to look at now. And to make it more beautiful, we have to just shade the inward. Because the light won't pass inside of this part. Since I am using a marker, it's not coming that proper. But when you are using a pencil on a paper sheet of paper, it will come exactly as you desire. There you are, the ear. So. I just do it here. A bean shape. The anterior part is little broad when compared to this posterior part. Extend. Next step. Draw a parallel line. Till two and half. Triangle shape. So moving further, draw a C elongated C and yes. And the last part from this point half. Take a curve and join this line. This should look like a funnel, this part. So it's somewhat similar to a funnel. And uh, shape the inside of the pinna. And he even this corner. And that's how you do a year. Please like and subscribe the channel. Leave a comment below in the comment section. Thank you.